what's your season prediction for the the Niners here? How far do you see them going after such a great turnaround last year? Do they they keep the pedal on the metal and get right back there, or do you think some regression's coming for the Niners? Okay, quick quick uh, disclaimer: this could be a very strange season. Mm-hmm. I mean, you you could have teams losing twelve players at a time with COVID. You could have teams losing head coaches for a month, quarterbacks. Right. So this might be a strange year, dude. But let's just assume that it's totally normal, uh, because we don't we can't predict that. Yeah. Let's assume it's a totally normal. It's a normal year. Um, I look at the schedule and feel like it's real favorable to the 49ers. I I don't see how they win fewer than 12 games, and I'm always looking for how they can lose games. I, I always <laughs> feel like people go too easy on them, and and uh, the the truth is somewhere in between. This year, I see 12 wins minimum, and a possibility to get 13 or 14. My question is, what are they going to do in the Super Bowl? What are they going to do? Not the Super Bowl, the playoffs. Will they get back to the Super Bowl? Will they win it? And what I see is the Niners are not better than last year. Schedule's easier, but they're not better than last year. Again, they did They did add Trent Williams, who's an upgrade over Joe Staley, but they lost Emmanuel Sanders, and they lost to Forrest Buckner. Those are, those are significant losses. Uh, and so... Jimmy Garoppolo to off, is, it ha, needs to offset that. Basically, they lost Emmanuel Sanders into DeForest Buckner because of Jimmy. Last year, Jimmy's accounted for, I believe, 8.6% of the 49er salary cap. Okay? This year, it's 12.9%. He's become very expensive. And when you're paying a quarterback that much of your cap, uh, you, you're going to have to lose some players, yeah. which means that he's going to have to make up the difference and play more like Matt Ryan or Tom Brady or Russell Wilson than uh, a game manager, a guy who is good sometimes and other other times is handing off. So um, I think it comes down to Jimmy. He needs to not only cut out the the interceptions, but be able to put the team on his back in certain key situations like he couldn't in the Super Bowl. So although I believe they're going to win 12 games, I don't think they're going to make it back to the Super Bowl. I think they're going to lose in the playoffs. And they're going to have some very difficult questions to ask themselves about the future of their team and if their Super Bowl window can stay open with Jimmy Garoppolo making $27 million a year. So who's knocking them off? Which team from the NFC is coming out then? Jeez. I, <laughs> I think, I think um, Tampa. I think really? Tampa's better than the 49ers. I think New Orleans better than the 49ers. And I would have the Niners third in the NFC, just a little bit ahead of Seattle. 